Hey, this is Adrian Wong Ken from Dirigo Design and Development. Today I'm going to show you how to export WebM from Adobe Premiere Pro. So once you've downloaded the plugin from the link below, you're going to want to go ahead and find that plugin in your download section. You're going to take the plugin, you're going to copy it, go over to your main hard drive where you're going to find your programs, go to Programs Files, Adobe, Common, Plugins, 7.0, go to the Media Core, mine's already there, go ahead and just paste it right in. Then you're going to open up Premiere Pro. Now, once you have your sequence finalized, like you'll see here, you're going to want to just export like you do normally. The only difference in this case is you're going to have a new option. So now that you've selected WebM, there's a couple things that you want to make sure that you do here. You're going to want to make sure that your frame size is right here. Right now I have this little widescreen type thing that we did for our website and you want to make sure that your pixel aspect ratio is in the right spot, frame rate. For web, I am choosing VP8. Make sure that it's at variable bit rate to pass. Encoding's on best. And then you're going to want to choose your encoding bit rate right here. Now, I was going for a size around 5 to 10 megabytes. So I can see down here that my file size is about 7. So that's all right, but let's bump it up just a little bit more. 10 megabytes is good. Now you can either choose to queue or export like you do normally. We'll hit export. And we wait. All right, great. It's done exporting, so we're going to go ahead and take a look at it. We have something here, and there it is. There's the final WebM version. And just to show it off, here is the final product on our website, deergodev.com.